Good morning, guys and girls. How the blooming devil are you? It's only blooming Wednesday already. We're up. We're on it. We're not as early as we'd like to be, but we're not late. Mood, mindset, so far, not bad. Feeling kind of positive. Better way to start the day. I haven't got that stupid little inner saboteur at me. So that's kind of a good vibe. I hope you're winning. I hope you're in a good place mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, emotionally. And uh, most of all, I hope you're making steps to achieving the things that you want out of 2023. On that, let's get this day rolling. You know the score by now. Get to work, get some coffee, see what the universe has in store for us. Hold that intro. Let the madness continue. Ten o'clock already. Just been sat, finished off the fully nuking podcast, and then listened to a Lex Fridman podcast or video, um, talking and looking into George Orwell's 1984. Pretty interesting. Pretty gnarly but also just made the morning pass super quick. Now, outside, get on the phone. My first person to call, Stella Paintworks. See if, we're, if we have any luck with those. And next step, coffee guy. My God, that tea break went absolutely just, yeah, like a bat out of hell. So I tried to find the first body shop on the list. It went to voicemail both times and I was kind of getting a bit concerned. I thought, you know what, I'll ping these guys an email and no sooner would I come through the door, I got a phone call back from them. So it uh, seems quite positive. The guy sounds like a legend. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, that's all I'm saying now. I'm not going to get too hyped. I'm not going to get too uh, excited. But that seems like a good one. Let's see where it goes. What's that about your beans? I was going to say, it's a little bit, bit breezy, mate. Well, is that because your hair's so long you can't see? Pretty much. <laughs> How are you, mate? You all right? I'm all right, mate. Oh, it must be bad. You've got a little beanie hat on as well. Oh, I've got to keep my ears warm, mate. Uh, I hate my ears getting cold. Yeah, I know. Getting naughty again, aren't I? The weather just demands it. Groggy weather, windy, double espresso. Well, oh, the day's slipping away. Lunchtime was good. This afternoon's flipped through. Highlight of the day so far was that the coffee guy said he sat at home last night and uh, kind of almost as a family vibe, they watched the vlog. And then he's not the first person to have said that. So that's pretty epic. Uh, it's three o'clock, man. We're going to go outside. Supposedly, from what I've heard, it's absolutely hammering it down. So it's probably going to be a break in the car. I've just been slogging it today, man. I'm trying to get... So much done. And uh, brain's just kind of like... Looking forward to this break. I just hope it's not absolutely hammering it down. Yeah. 
Oh my days. Yeah. Lovely weather, baby. Woo! Get the surfboard out. Let's go. Yes. So, lunchtime we spent kind of drying the car off. Oh, dude. I was so sucked out, man. I've left my keys indoors, haven't I? I wonder if I locked it. I'm going to find out. Uh, oh, man, this just sucks. So I've done my very best at lunchtime to get as much moisture damp out of the car as possible. And uh, yeah, it just feels as damp as it did this morning. So it's kind of crazy. It has stopped raining, so that's a winner. But man, I don't know. I might have to get some dehumidifier packs or I um, could be really crazy and try to figure out how I can actually run an extension lead out to the car. Get the actual dehumidifier we own in the car and maybe run it for a day or something just to try to dry it out it's madness but i'm praying we don't get any more rain but i don't think that's going to happen anyway we're in the car let's do it let's go home well i was going to get home and go in on a few just different tangents one i've started the meditations by marcus aurelius that's going to be a heavy audio book listen i know it I might have to go off and do a little bit more extra research here and there to try to kind of get a grasp of it being refreshed in today's language, if that makes sense. Um, apart from that, watched a few gnarly videos on YouTube, going in on some heavy topics. Uh, watched a Lex Fridman episode on George Orwell's 1984, which is very interesting. And I also, I can never, it's like the dry ranch. I've mentioned the guy before. He's kind of just, I don't know, he's just your traditional kind of cowboy vibe, man. I love it. It's epic. Love listening to his stories and he's got a certain way of telling them. Uh, a video on the lost generation, which is pretty heavy. Uh, I'm going to put links for all of those videos in the description below. If you want to get in there and just have a poke around and check them out for yourselves, that's up to you guys. Uh, let me know in the comments below if uh, you want to open up a kind of discussion about that kind of stuff who knows apart from that though i am going to keep it short and sweet because i'm going to try to wrap the edit up today real soon and get an early night i've been burning the candle at both ends and it is not doing me too well because i tend to be getting home from work and just falling asleep for a little while so yeah madness is real as ever i hope you're winning i hope you're well i hope the week's treating you good like i said first thing this morning i hope you're doing well mentally physically spiritually financially and emotionally the world we live in is gnarly just having this conversation with someone about how we live in a world today where at the touch of a button we compare ourselves to like 8 billion people or something. Can you imagine going back maybe 100 years or something when really your only comparisons or life goals and achievements and like standard that you wanted to get to was only really governed by the people that lived in your surrounding area, in your village, in your town, very small number of people your aspirations and ideals were governed by that. Whereas nowadays we just switch on a device, man, and everybody's living the best lifestyle, looking the best way, working out the, the hardest, the, you know, they're just doing it all. And uh, I feel like it's kind of crazy. I just don't think the human mind is even ready for that yet. But that's a whole different topic for a whole different day. Take it easy, have a fantastic evening. As always, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate the hell out of you guys supporting the channel. Thank you. I hope you're well. Take it easy. Have a fantastic evening. I'll see you same time, same place tomorrow.